Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're having a beautiful and inspiring day and thank you so much for joining me today for another art video. Today I am sharing video number 16 for my personal sketchbook series and today I am filling up this sketchbook spread with four different little quick sketches of animals. If you've been watching my videos here on YouTube or you've been part of any of the online communities that I have been uh, growing throughout the last couple of years, you're probably already aware that I am a huge believer in quicker studies and explorations. I consider myself to be primarily a painter. I sell my watercolor paintings. I also create acrylic and oil paintings on canvas and canvas board. However, I really believe in keeping a sketchbook habit and continuing to create smaller drawings, smaller sketches, smaller explorations in between larger projects. And this is something that I really prioritize and I want to make sure that I continue doing throughout my entire artistic journey. I also 100% believe that drawing is the basis for all kinds of art. And honestly, what I have found is that the more I develop my drawing and my sketching skills, my observational skills, my hand-eye coordination, all of that via drawing and sketching, the easier my painting process becomes because these skills kind of permeate and overlap with everything else. And that's really why I started sharing these sketchbook videos here on YouTube because I really hope to inspire some of you guys out there to make time for smaller studies and explorations that maybe aren't even intending to be finalized or turned into a finalized piece or maybe not even shown to other people. Do it for yourself, for the process, to get to know yourself as an artist, to be able to focus in on the specific subjects that interest you and you want to improve in, to test new techniques, get to know different mediums, and continue improving your skills in a less pressured and overwhelming way. Sometimes when we jump straight to the canvas or straight to the piece that is intending to meant to be finalized or something like that, we have the added pressure of not wasting expensive supplies and creating something completely perfect and things. And these kinds of studies and explorations really have helped me embrace imperfection and not to mention has really allowed me to understand the value behind the entire creative process as opposed to only the finalized outcome. And this is exactly why I decided to start sharing these personal sketchbook videos here on YouTube because I really hope to inspire others out there to also embrace imperfection and make time for those personal studies, make time for that sketchbook work and not only place your value as an artist on the finalized polished pieces that you create, but also to all of the learning and all of the process and all of the mistakes and experimentations and the introspection and the self-evaluation that is going on behind the scenes. All right, you guys, so those are just a few of my thoughts in regards to sketchbooks and smaller pieces. Um, I am now going to leave you to hopefully enjoy the rest of this time lapse. But before I do that, I want to send out a huge welcome to all of you new people just visiting my channel today for the very first time. I am super happy that you found me and do consider subscribing because every single week I share new videos with art tips, drawing and painting tutorials and encouragement for aspiring artists. And if you do subscribe, don't forget to click on that little notification bell so that YouTube can let you know whenever I publish a new video. Otherwise, you may or may not find out about it. I'd love to hear from you in the comment section below. Let me know which little sketch you like best. And of course, if you have any questions about my drawing process or the supplies that I am using for these or anything at all, also make sure to leave them down below in the comment section and I promise to get back to you as soon as I can.
All right, you guys, that is gonna do it for this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it and that you got inspired to go and do some sketchbook work for yourself. And if you did enjoy it, please, please, please make sure to give it a thumbs up because it really helps support the work that I'm doing here on YouTube and helps other people get to know about my channel. I'm gonna be leaving a couple of drawing videos right here for you to enjoy next. And thank you so much for watching. I wish you a beautiful rest of the day and talk to you very, very soon. Bye guys.